y'all it's Nona and today I'm here with my monthly collab series that I do with my friend Tara over at a nerdy grandma and in this series we try to use uh oh a couple of different uh, makeup products for a month and come back and give y'all our opinions uh, review um, thoughts would I repurchase um, whatever whatever if we're gonna keep it and pan it or declutter it or you know just what we think of the products uh, the first um, year or so we did this we did it over foundations because we both had a very large uh, makeup collection and we both love foundation so uh, then we decided to switch over around the beginning of the year to uh, colored face products and um, I decided to do my face palettes um, they could be anything from bronzer, contour, powders, um, blush, highlighter, you name it. So, each month I pull out two of my face palettes and I use them throughout the month along with the rest of my Shop My Stash products. And I come back and let y'all know what I think. So, this month I chose two uh, Revolution palettes. This one is the I Heart Revolution Praline palette. I absolutely love their chocolate um pack palette packaging it's so pretty it's really heavy it feels luxe i really like it comes with a large mirror and then these are the shades uh we have a very dark bronzer a shimmery blush which could probably be a blush topper especially on darker skins um a darker highlighter or blush topper for lighter skin tones a shimmery bronzer or a dark highlighter and then a really light icy gray tone silvery type highlighter and I have those swatched here. They're this row right here at the bottom. This started the bronzer and then the blush topper, the darker highlighter, the glowy bronzer, and then the white icy highlighter. I think they're beautiful. Um, you can blend out this um, bronzer. So you can use it even if you have lighter skin. It blends out really pretty same with the blush topper you could definitely use that as a blush a standalone blush if you're if you're light enough it blends out um, again you might be able to get away with this darker highlighter even on lighter skin because again they blend out so beautifully so I really really enjoyed that palette I will say that my favorite uh, product in the palette was um, this highlighter the really sparkly fondant I really I really did like that um I thought it was very pretty I know a lot of people don't like those white type highlighters but I do <laughs> I, I just really do okay and then the second palette that I pulled was also from the I Heart Revolution line and this one is in waffle and isn't that really pretty I just love it I just think it's so fun and then these are the shades and in this one we have a super dark uh, blush which I absolutely love this is a gorgeous blush a darker highlighter a more shimmery bronzer this could be a very light bronzer or even a powder uh, on some skin tones because it is matte and then this is a more warm toned um, leaning bronzer than the other palette it's also a lot lighter so I will show you I have those swatched here starting here is the bronzer and then moving along the powder the glowy bronzer um, the more gray toned lavender type highlighter and then that really pretty blush I did swatch that blush twice to get that pigment but I don't mind that at all. I, I like to, to build my products. Again, these are all very, very easy to blend. This one is a little bit orange. I know some people don't like that. Um, I think when it's blended out, it could work for some people. It's a, it's a little, it's got a yellow undertone. Um, but I will tell you that my favorite product in this one is this blush. I absolutely love it. It is called Maple Syrup. Um, I really like both of these palettes. Um, 
I don't need any more, but, <laughs> but I would totally purchase more um, face pro uh, palettes out of the I Heart Revolution line. I, I just really enjoy their products. They, they are hit and miss, um, in my opinion, but I will say that um, more recently, uh, their launches are consistently good, um, which, you know, I think all makeup lines improve over time, and uh, so, yeah, I, I would recommend both palettes, um, so, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to tell you a little bit about Tara. She's a very funny person. She's, um, like her channel name says, nerdy. She's nerdy. Um, she's a little eccentric. Um, she likes, you know, video games and comics and just, you know, all the nerdy stuff. Harry Potter and all that good stuff. Um, she's also very, very knowledgeable about makeup and especially skincare. She works in that field in her real life job um so if you have like questions about skincare or anything like that she's the one I would direct you to um she's been uh away for a month or two she hasn't been filming much um and I hope she comes back soon but um she does hauls she does project pans uh she does an advent calendar type project pan um, where her husband has chosen the products for her. I know that they are remodeling um, a part of their house to give her a larger beauty room <laughs> because her enormous collection has outgrown her space. And um, th that's something she and I bonded over that we both have a really large collection. Um, she's kind and considerate and caring and just everything that you want in a friend and I just love her to pieces. She and I have done lots of collabs. Uh, we were in the uh, Birthstone collab group together and uh, she's just a really sweet person. So I want to thank you for creating this collab, Tara, for inviting me to do it with you and for being my friend. I love you, girl. If you like these types of videos, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Love to all. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.